Hey everybody, it's me, Sissy. Today I have little Miss Munchkin. You gonna say hey? You gonna go say hey? Yeah. This is my Miss Munchkin. I, she's a rescue dog, so I'm all for rescuing dogs from your local um, animal shelter, or SPCA, or rescue groups. So little Miss Munchkin came from our local SPCA, and I just love her. She's such a sweet baby, and she loves her mama. Um, <laughs> we went to the beach recently. We boarded her at uh, our vet, and they asked me not to bring her back. <laughs> she missed her mommy, and first you showed honey, huh? You was a bad girl. So we're going to get her a little bit of training. Her was just scared. Her didn't think mommy was coming back. But I'm coming back for that baby. Okay? Love you. Okay. So let's get to the Dollar Tree haul. You gotta love them. I'm, I'm thrilled that she loves me so much. She didn't want. She missed me, but I wish she had behaved a little better. But anyway, we're gonna. I, I think our le local um, Petco. Yeah, I think it's Petco. They um, have a little obedience class uh, that she can go to. So I'm gonna take her to that and give her a little good citizen award. But anyway, let's get to the Dollar Tree haul. I got some Christmas stuff. I've got. Some craft stuff. Oh, it's just a mixed bag of stuff today. But let's start with this little bag of Crafter Square Snowballs. I thought these would be cute just in a little tin bucket. But, um, you got to get ready for that decorating. And if you see stuff at Dollar Tree now, get it. Or it won't be there next time. And then I picked up this little wooden decor piece for a dollar. It says Jolly on it. And it has uh, a paper background. I think I'm going to change this up a little bit. Um do a little DIY or redo on it so y'all stay tuned for that I'm gonna to try to get started on my um, decorating and Christmas crafts I know I'm a little behind schedule but I'm working on it so then I just picked up some of the Surefresh zipper slide gallon storage bags I like to use those and then this is my find of the of the holiday season I think I found these pretty silver um, charger plates. I don't know if you can see they're embossed with the little snowflake edge on it. So I thought those would be really cute to use on my dining table for Christmas or even to um, you could mod podge or decoupage something in the center here or put some kind of vinyl with a saying on it. They'd be great for crafts. So I might try to do some of those. If I could find some more of them. I don't know why. I just I just picked up four when I was at Dollar Tree. I'm trying to be better about only buying things that I know that I'm going to use because uh, it's not saving money if you don't use the stuff. And I picked up these cute little Christmas home uh, gift tags that are just the colors that I love to use for Christmas. So I picked those up. It's 18. My little tiny family, that'll probably be enough for all my gifts. So, and um, let's see. Oh, I got this little... Uh, metal house and uh, it's supposed to have a candle cup on the inside of it to put a little votive candle uh, this one um, unfortunately or unfortunately doesn't have one but I'm going to use it for a DIY and I really needed the cup to be gone anyway so that worked out for me and last time I was at Dollar Tree I forgot to pick up my napkins for Thanksgiving so uh, these match my plates so I got the uh dinner napkins and the dessert napkins and I thought they kind of coordinated and looked good together and I got the matching plates and platters so let's see what else we got uh, I found some more little trees these are uh, six pieces of the little tiny silver trees I'm gonna I've got a little shelf in my um, living room and I'm just gonna put all different kind of little trees on it and make it like a little Christmas tree for us so when I get that done I'll show you and I do have one Dollar Tree Plus item in here that I found I was really excited to find it because I really needed it it was the Christmas tree collar it's five dollars it's two pieces and it goes around the bottom of your Christmas tree to kind of cover up your stand make it look a little more finished I'm gonna see if I can get this this I've got farm fresh Christmas trees on it in red and I'm gonna see if I can get that off because I don't really use the red color in my Christmas decorations decorating so um but if I can't get it off it'll be fine but 
I'm, I'm going to see if I can. If I do, I'll show y'all what I do to it. I'm, gonna put, I'm thinking I'm going to put some vinyl on there in my colors that says Farm Fresh Christmas Trees or Holly Jolly or something like that. And speaking of Christmas trees, I do have another bag of trees in here. Um, I kind of went tree crazy. They had all these cute trees. They have these little um, white ones that kind of have that design, the shape in them, kind of Dr. Susie. I love those. And so I got two of, two, two or three of those. Three. Well, there's a different size, a smaller one, and a tall one. And then they had a lovely purpley pink one. And then they had this gorgeous ombre kind of teal colored one. And then another teal one with some beads in it. So I've got all those. So I think I have enough trees now. <laughs> I don't need any more to make my forest. So let me just get these out of the way before I knock them over. And I picked up a spray bottle. This is for one of my crafts. Well, I'm doing these uh, t-shirts that are bleached and I got a bottle to put my bleach in. And I found, this was a great find for me, the Crafter Square um, Craft Scraper and Craft Spatula. These are very, very similar to the Cricut brand scraper and spatula. So I, I picked those up because um, my Cricut one is long gone. I can't can't find it. I don't know what to do with it. So uh, it's good to only pay a dollar for them. Then I picked up the Bolero um, facial cleanser. This is hibiscus and chamomile. I'm gonna give that a try. I always when I get the face products, I always do a little test on a, a, a not right in front of my face, like on the back back of my cheek right here to make sure I'm not going to break out. I, some of y'all know I have um, eczema, so I have to be really careful about what I put on my face. So then I picked up the Fabuloso with vinegar apple flavored. Apple, not flavored. Don't, don't drink it. It's um, apple scented. Uh, it smells really good. I smelled it in the store. It has a really nice, fresh, crispy, apple-y smell and a little tinge of vinegar in there. So, and I, I'm, y'all, I'm one of those weirdos. I like the smell of vinegar. So, then I picked up a cute little puppy. He's dressed as Santa, but I'm going to redo him. I saw online um, of this cute little Christmas decoration, so I'm going to see if I can remake it using this Dollar Tree puppy. So, y'all stay tuned for that. And this wasn't a great big haul. It was just a few things. So we're almost at the end. I picked up a string of the 20 count mini lights in the multiple colors. And then they have them. It's five feet long. And it's indoor use only. But then they have the ones that are clear too. So I, I But I want the colors. So I picked those up. And then my last little item was the uh, Bolero Brighten Up Honey and Vitamin C paper facial mask. I love a good face mask. And I have used the Bolero. Um, these don't break my face out. They don't irritate my face. I have a real problem with the ones that are the um, gel you put on and then you peel it off. Um, those seem to, something must be something in the gel that makes it firm up. And make, it really irritates my skin so I try not to use those. So I, like, again I'd advise if you get any of those facial products to test it on a a little spot just do a spot test to make sure you don't have a reaction to it before you use it but anyway y'all that's my Dollar Tree haul uh, I'm so glad to be back on YouTube and I thank you to everybody who left all the sweet comments welcome me back I know I I took a little leave there but I'm back now three weeks in a row so <laughs> that's a kind of a streak for me but anyway y'all stay tuned and see my um, craft videos coming up I'm gonna you know start it's not gonna all be Dollar Tree crafts I do a lot of other crafts that don't involve Dollar Tree stuff at all I know that's terrible but i do i do all kind of stuff but i'm gonna share that with y'all so we'll see y'all soon have a great day bye bye